up YouTube? Doing a lot of time here talking about what's been going on with the channel and what's been going on with the channel and what's been going on and what's been going on. Continuing, so um, I'm going to start doing more things on this channel, more videos. Hopefully, hopefully, no promises, guys, no promises. The all, the, the 13 of you that that are waiting for more content. I'm sorry. I'm horrible. You know. But, man, why am I trying to be so, like, weird in this video? I, I need to chill, chill. Okay. okay. So, YouTube. So, Sheen Liquid Panda. I'm going to leave all that stuff in the beginning there, so, yeah. But, Sheen Liquid Panda here. And, this is what's going on with the channel, what's going to happen in the future of the channel. So far, I haven't been able to upload videos on a schedule just because life doesn't allow me to exist in a schedule right now everything's everywhere and even when i eat that might not happen for an entire day it might happen the next day because of scheduling so even sleep is like yeah you might get to sleep an hour two hours maybe life's crazy right now but it's, it's good everything's good um i'm gonna start talking about I want to keep doing nunchuck videos, right? I really want to talk about, um, like, closed nunchuck techniques. And I really want to talk about getting... I really want to talk about being better at stances, like T-dachi, and um, I think it's called Sagi-dachi, which is crane stances I'm thinking of. I'm probably pronouncing that wrong. And... and and Kensuku Dachi, I might also be pronouncing that wrong. If I pronounce anything wrong, type me out the pronunciation in the comments, please. I really would appreciate that. Um, I'm also working on Tanfa at this moment, and um, I'm a big fan of Kobudo and Karate in general, and I really want to learn the Tanfa. Um, and I'm also um, taking a little bit of my Tanfa experiences and applying it to the uh, the PR24, um, when I used to work security, I had a PR24, so that's kind of why I really love the Tanfa, because I know what it can do, because I've, I've used it myself. So, right, um, and I want to make a video reviewing these Tanfa, because these are really good Tanfa, I've kind of bashed them up pretty badly, but they're really good Tanfa made of polypropylene, but this isn't the review, so you'll hear about it when I get to the review. I'm also going to talk about my research material. The books I use to study martial arts. I don't want to say learn martial arts because I'm, I'm really trying to work on getting a lot better. And studying sounds better than learning to me because learning means I understand this and I'm the master of this. Studying is like I'm going to keep gaining more information from this over and over and over again. So I didn't mean to go on a rant and explain that, but that's just a feeling, an idea of mine. Um, uh, another thing I want to do is talk about books. I want to talk about um, martial arts books, some philosophy stuff, some philosophy books like the Shonin Ken, which might not be philosophy, that's like ninjutsu, and the Book of Five Rings, which is Musashi Miyamoto. I want to talk about the, the Code of the Samurai. I want to talk about I want to talk about um, that one Bruce Lee one. I can't remember the name of. I don't currently own it. That's why I don't remember the name of it. Um, but a bunch of martial arts books like that that I want to talk about. I also want to talk about actual, like martial arts books you can study for techniques. And like those are like, I'm talking like stuff written by Fuma Demera and other books like that. Oh, Fuma Demera is the main name I can think of off the top of my head. But there's many more authors I want to talk about. The thing I'm really excited to talk about is um, martial arts films such as Chocolate and... Um, and Ice Man, Ip Man, um, oh, I really want to talk about Wrath of the Vajra, and Bushido Man, and High Kick Angels, and I really want to get that new one by Jackie Chan that's coming out, uh, Railroad Tigers, I think it's called, I might be pronouncing that wrong, but it's something, it's Railroad, and then it's Tigers, or it's Tigers, and then it's Railroads, something like that, it looks cool, I really want to see it, and I want to talk about Sam Hung, Jackie Chan, Bruce, uh, Sam Oh Hung, sorry, Bruce Lee, Donnie Yin, Jackie Chan, Bruce Lee, um, oh, I 
can't believe I forgot how to pronounce the girl's name that's in chocolate. Um, um. G, G, J, Yin. It's G, it's, by the way, if you guys are looking this up, it's J, I, J, A, Y, A, N, I, N. That's how you spell her name. So if I pronounce that wrong, at least you have the spelling. And she's one of my favorite. Her, her martial arts style is so awesome. Her, Sammo Hong, Bruce Lee, those dudes are like my heroes. Like, especially Sam O Hong. And if you can't tell why, you know, enter that fat dragon. But, um, and it's going to be so exciting to talk about that stuff. Unfortunately, I'm not going to be able to show video of it because, um, partially because YouTube will take me down. But that's not the, the real reason because if I get taken down by YouTube, I, I lose like, what, 13 subscribers? Maybe. What? Well, and I'm mostly here to talk about martial arts, not make anything out of this, so. Um, but mostly because I don't have a way to edit anything together and I really don't want to like edit anything together that I feel would take any ad any money away from these films. I would like you to go see these films. I'm not even going to review the films. I'm not going to give them like a score like this movie gets a 10 out of 10 or a 1 out of 4 whatever. No. I'm going to this part in this movie is cool. I'll give you an example of what I mean. Um, in Ralph of the Roger, when they do the 17 seconds of death at the end of the movie, it is so cool. And he's like, blah, 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 blah. And he masters the 17 seconds of death because he, he finally realizes that his brother's alive and he gains the the uh, the, 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 the love of Vajra or something. It's so cool. And um, that, that's what I mean. I want to talk like that. And when he throws the guy in the coffin at the beginning of the movie, that's so cool. And that movie's so weird because there's like... Why are Japanese worshipping the Hades, Hades, which is like a Greek god and of death? And it's like, I understand it kind of makes sense, but it doesn't really need to make sense because it's so cool. Um, also, if you guys know what a Vajra is, I would like to know because I don't know what a Vajra is. I should look it up. And I want to talk about Bushido Man, although that movie makes me way too hungry. So I'm probably going to talk about that movie way when my when I can like figure out this like when I can figure things out a little bit better and um but yeah yeah so whatever whatever but basically I'm really looking forward to talking about martial arts films and martial arts books and tanfa and um I'm hoping also to do a review on some other things like my boxing gloves um let me think my boxing gloves I'm hoping to do a review and let's see my knife uh a few of my knives um, um let's see um definitely a lot of martial arts books are going to be on my list oh okay well um i'm pretty much gonna wrap it up here because i don't want the video to go on forever but um see you youtube um any requests for anything needed for any if you want me to talk about anything in particular put it down in comments and yeah.